hey guys, it is um, one shot eyesight week here on Pottercast because I'm so busy, I'm going crazy. Sorting and um, if they do it too soon. You know what? We asked J.K. Rowling this in 2005. We said, is the sorting hat ever wrong? And she said no. And my response to her in that moment was, that seems to indicate that the sorting hat is pulling from a person's head. And she just nodded. You can go and look in that, at that interview. I'll try and link it in the, in the um, requirement. Um, I believe in that. I think the hat has to pull its information from someplace, even though it, can, it can't think for itself. Arthur Weasley. And I think that that means it's seeing things about a person that maybe they don't even know. Like how Hermione ended up in Gryffindor when she's so smart. When her prevailing quality is that she's so smart, she ended up in Gryffindor because she's stupendously brave, and she didn't know that about herself at 11. I always say that I would be a Gryffindor now, but I probably would have been in Ravenclaw at 11. And, and thinking about this now, I think that maybe it would have chosen Gryffindor for me, knowing the kinds of things I would be doing in the future, and or, or seeing that element in me that I didn't see in myself then. And nobody would have been more surprised than me to be in Gryffindor in at 11, because at 11... Um, yeah, I didn't see myself as a brave person at all, but now I think it's more of a quality, um, for me than I, than I ever imagined. Um, I know everybody wants to be in Gryffindor, and so it's like, you know, saying you're a true Gryffindor is, is, is kind of egotistical, so I'm not, you know, I, but, but I'm trying to answer this honestly, I, I, I think that for reasons that are both good and bad, um, so do they do they sort too soon? Maybe, you know, no, 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 they don't because who's to say? Like if, like for instance, would 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 Snape have been different if he was sorted into Gryffindor? Absolutely, it's a life changing choice. It's an important choice in your life. Everybody's going to be different if you're sorted into a different place. But if 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 that happens for a lot of people, if everybody gets shifted around, everything would be different. Nothing would be the same. And I don't think that we have um, the capability of telling what would happen if things have changed it's a it's 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 an it's a very it's an important human thing that we do where we try and imagine what if something was different i think we do that to be honest way too much and one of the struggles of life is accepting what is and um i don't think that we have the proper function in our head to encapsulate all the factors that would change once once one thing changes, it's like it's like again the butterfly flapped its wing effects, you know. So, no, no, I, no, no. I think I think I think anytime they sort, whether good or bad, whether it changes anything, it just that's what is now. Snape is a Slytherin. James is a Gryffindor. Harry is a Gryffindor. That is an irre- uncontrovertible fact, and we can't um, we can't know whether or not it's too soon or too late or whether they couldn't be sorting at all. It's just a fact about life. So no, I think it's, I think it's, it is where it, where it should be. And any other place it would have been is also where it should be. Cause it's not a question of, is it, is it good? Is it bad? It's a question of this is what happened and how does it affect the world? Yeah. I will see you guys next week.